Okay, so who's going to read the subtraction sentence for me that Frog's doing? Miller. Very good. 65, subtract 58. Which is the smallest number out of those two numbers? Which is the smallest number? 58. Esme. 58, that's right. Can you see that, Ahmed? Frog's going to start on 58 there. Okay, where's Frog going to jump to first then? What's my next multiple of 10 after 58? Harvey. 60. Come and check, see if you're right. Has Frog hopped to 60? Yes, very good. Okay. And then Frog's going to hop all the way to 65. So, let's see Froggy hop. Woohoo! Okay, how far has Frog hopped? Who can tell me? Anna, I bet you know. How far has Frog hopped from 58 to 60? Do you want to come? Two. Two. Do you want to come and check and see if you're right? Anna thinks two. What do you think? Thumbs up if you think she's got it right. Thumbs down if you think she's got it wrong. Yes, well done, Anna. Excellent. Now, this is a bit of a big hop. Seth, do you want to come and touch here? So, make Frog do a nice big hop. <coughs> Bless you. Woohoo! <gasps> oh, now that was a big hop. How far has Frog hopped? How far has Frog hopped, Charlie? Five. Five. Do you want to come and check? Can you reach that cloud? Let's come and see. Five. Very good, Charlie. Well done. Now, what do we need to do to get our answer? I've forgotten. Who's going to help me? Layla, what do we need to do? What do you do to the frog's hops to get your answer? Do you remember? Do you want a bit of help? Um, William, can you help her out? You add. You add them. That's right. So I'm expecting everyone to be able to add those. Kira, you've had your hand up for a long time. What's my answer? What's two and five? Two add five. Seven. Let's have a look. Seven. Kira, would you like to read the whole number sentence now? Sixty-five subtract five. Fifty-eight equals seven. Very good. Sixty-five minus fifty-eight or subtract fifty-eight is seven. 